Hi there, this is Raul from It Took Things. Today I'm going to show you how to create this welcome section, the service section, the newsletter section, the blog section, and this call to action section, the homepage setting section. First of all, go to the dashboard. Let's create a post for the welcome section. Let's add new post. Let's give a title Jinchi Light, and I'm just gonna copy some content from here. Just gonna copy this paragraph and paste it here. Let's publish it. After that, we need to go to appearance and customize. Let's open the customize here. After opening the customize, go to this home page setting. Let's go to compose section and choose the GNC light we just made. Your post is showing here. I just want to show 400 character. And I want the text to be a bit more. You can click here to enable the full content. If you don't want the full content and only want to show some character, you can just disable it. If you, you can also create the full width like this. If you don't want the service section, I want the service section, so I'm not going to check the full width. Now I'm going to show you how to create the service section. Let's go to the service section. Yeah, you need to create some post. I'm just going to choose some post I have already created. And you need to give some font or some icon. Like this. The trophy is showing. I'm gonna choose another post and give an another icon. To give an icon, you can go to this sorry font awesome icon. I'm gonna provide this link in our description below. After you go to this site, you can have any icon, I just want this anchor icon there. So to put the anchor icon in the customize, you need to put FA and anchor. The anchor icon is shown. Let's choose another post. And I'm gonna choose, let's choose, okay, this iPhone post and I'm gonna give this icon phone icon and just save it let's check in our front end how our welcome post and service section is showing you can see the welcome post and the service section now let's check in the demo what's below that section this is the newsletter section. I am going to show you how to create a newsletter section here. First of all, to create a newsletter section, you need a plugin called Newsletter. You just need to add new plugin and search for newsletter. After you are done searching the newsletter plugin, you need to install the plugin. This is the plugin, I have already installed it. You just need to install and activate it. After you done that, a widget will be shown in the widget bar, the newsletter widget. 
I want this newsletter in this subscribe newsletter section. I'm gonna add it. Now you need to give a title. Better. I'm just gonna copy some content and paste it here. And I want the subscription form below that content. You just need to copy this and paste it here. I'll save it. Now let's go to the front end and check if our subscription newsletter is showing or not. You can check the newsletter is showing here. Now I'm going to show you how to create the block section. Go to the customize and go to about call to action section you need to enable it after that you need to choose a category I'm just gonna choose a category I've already made you can see our blog is showing here let's save it if you don't know how to make a category you need to go to the dashboard and category you need to give a name to the category and add a new category and in there you need to add some post there now let's go back to the customize and I'm going to show you how to add the call to action button the call to action section for that you need to enable the section and you need to give the button text download now and give the link here you can use the HTML text like this as I have used here you can check out this how I have used this is all the home page setting for now thank you for watching this video and be sure to subscribe to our new channel thank you